Hi guys, welcome to Do Daily Wednesday. Um, just been out for a quick walk. Uh, too much wind about to do a video out there. I was trying, but thought I'd come back, post up. I uh, want to start with saying what a great turnout again for the solidarity session last night. Brilliant. Um, so many out doing some kind of activity. All at the same time, but of course all in a different place. Really, really enjoy the solidarity sessions and this week I think I needed it to be honest. Um, so I really enjoyed it. I took a run over to a normal meeting point on a Tuesday. Uh, reminded me how much I'm missing the guys but it was nice to sort of get over there and go over some familiar paths, some familiar routes. Um, just reminding me of uh, some of the good times we've had. But it won't be forever and of course we'll get back there so... Um, Trying to stay positive about all that. Like I said, I needed the one um, I had a presentation to do today. Uh, and to be honest, I've been letting it test me out a little bit, as much as I'm encouraging you guys. Um, I, it's been in the back of my mind all week, thinking a bit too much about it. But it's done now. Uh, there's nothing else I can do about it. You can probably hear already I'm a, I'm a little bit perky about things. Um, I'll have to wait and see how it turns out. But like I keep saying, I um, can't be defined by that now, what's, what's done is done. I'm hoping for some good news and some good feedback, but only time will tell in that, on that one. So um, I don't know at the end of the week, but in the meantime, I've got lots more to go at. Do you know, we've got the uh, questions and answers tomorrow. So if anyone's got any burning questions, doesn't doesn't have to be just about running, it can be about anything. Um, you can ask me anything, within reason of course. Um, I might regret that, but there you go. <laughs> uh, yeah, you can, you can ask anything, post them in the comments, anything sort of related to activity, the situation, sort of how, how to inspire and motivate. Of course, that's all I'm trying to do here, is just uh, keep spirits high, keep people, sort of keep offering the opportunity for people to stay safe, stay active. And of course, stay positive. It's really, really important to stay positive, guys. Like I say, I, I had something to deal with early in the week, but the, posit the positive thing for me to look forward to was the run last night, and I really did. I got the most from it. Just an hour where I could take, my, take myself away from what I was thinking, from what I, what I was uh, a little bit worried about. And by, by making myself busy and doing all these things, doing these videos day in, day out, I'm forgetting what's actually happening out there. And that's what you can do too. You can almost um, just keep planning, keep putting things in the diary, keep embracing things. That's the most important thing. Um, I, I figured, um, not, not so much during recent times, but even before that, when I took up running and exercise and, and wanting to sort of inspire people, um, the, the real key to it is actually sort of committing and dedicating yourself to something just by saying yes and by taking, taking it on fully, 100%. Like the solidarity sessions, get out at the same time if you can. Make an effort to change. Uh, there's no problem if you really can't do it, but why not just join us at 6.30? Just have a look what it's about. I did a I did a personal post last night saying, if you don't get it, you're not doing it right. And it wasn't meant to be sort of, it wasn't having a go at anybody or anything. It was just meant, come on, give it a try, do you know? And when you embrace things, you, you start sort of looking forward to them. You're more likely to do them. That's that's the reality. If you say you're going to do something, as as, as normal human beings, we, we tend to do it if we can. So um, yeah, just just throw yourself into things. Of course, the restrictions have um, sort of lessened a little bit. There's less restrictions from today. I've just been out for a short walk to do this video. I wanted to walk for longer. Fortunately, I can go out again now. Um, still keeping good good social distance between people. Whereas before I'd have had to come home and I'd have had to sort of forfeit the rest of my run, uh, walk, sorry. I can now do this video, get it posted up for you guys and go for go for some more sort of exercise. Which is a, a good thing. Um, whatever your opinions are on the situation, um, being able to exercise and being able to do it in a safe manner is it totally down to, to, to the individual. Do you know, it takes two to get get too close to each other so if you do your thing if you stay positive and you, you you you're aware of the rules and you're aware of your own space then 
you can't go wrong, you know. Nobody can come into your space if you don't let them. So get out there, keep doing it. Of course, if you can do it more than once. In reality, not many people exercise more than once a day, and once a day can be um, just enough. So if you can get out for a run or a walk or a cycle, please do. Please keep letting us know. Like I said, I touched on what we're going to do tomorrow with the with the questions and answers. It's a bit of a tough one for me again. Kind of like I look forward to it, but of course I'm I'm learning on this. So again, I'm out of my comfort zone, just like the presentation. So it'll be something I'm thinking about, something I'm wanting wa wanting to get right. So if I can get it right, it'll make me feel good, and it'll make me feel good anyway. But it'll just be me looking forward again to something else. Um, keeping myself busy, keeping myself preoccupied from from that that situation that we know is around us. Um, I mentioned yesterday, me me and Kay personally are uh, keeping away from the news this week. We know the situation is not going to change. We we've checked out the the rules and regulations, and of course we'll know if anything dramatically changes. So we've just made a conscious effort effort to keep away from the news. Of course, do dailies on at six o'clock. So. You don't need part of it. You can watch this. You can watch me. Um, I'm go. I'll go out and listen to it, listen to it back. Listen to what I've said. Listen to what I've been sparking off now. But it's just another option whilst you're out and about. Catch up with some of the old, old episodes. It seems like I've been doing it forever now. I think um, it's just over two weeks. So um, really enjoying doing it. Really enjoying getting some great feedback and um, passing on my thoughts of. Of how things are going, how things are going personally for me, you know, and, and setting these little challenges in the meantime. Of course, we've got tomorrow, then on Friday, I'll be setting another little challenge for Saturday. Probably get out for a walk again. I've got a little idea in my head and I'm quite looking forward to that. And then further to that, we've got the Sunday social on the Zoom if anybody would like to join us. So the message today, obviously, with the with the lesson restrictions, it's just really, really, we want you to stay safe, do you know. The campaign that's been run by Get Out, Get Active Nottingham, um, the Stay Safe, Stay Active campaign, it's, it's all about that. Do you know, whether it's Do Running, the This Girl Cam programme they run, or Get Out, Get Active themselves, all we want you to do is um, really stay safe, stay positive. Really, positive positivity is key right now. And if you can, um, if you can keep spirits high, um, or if you need to join us to sort of help you with that, please do. Do you know we're we're open to everybody. We are based in a in a particular locality, but of course with having to take this thing online now, it's um it's a great opportunity to get involved. I'm enjoying it so much. We're not we we will go back to our regular activity, but there'll always be a, a place for do daily now because it's something I want to do. I want to attract new people. I love getting. I love it when somebody says to me, yes, I, I went out for a run. I got a tweet the other day, just a small tiny tweet, a lady saying um, we'd give her a nice little nudge in the right direction to get her out walking by the river again. And and, and that's exactly what what we, we want, you know. We don't want to scare people into running marathons or doing triathlons. Of course, if, if you want to build up to that and if you want to get into those things, there is a place for sort of that kind of activity too, but we don't want to scare anyone. We just want to be a safe space, a, an online community, do you know? Nothing you have to sort of commit to or dedicate to, dedicate yourself fully to. What I always say with the um, with the groups I run locally is attendance is absolutely at the individual's at discretion. So please don't feel obligated. But it'd be great to have your support. It'd be great to have you with us, and it'd be great to try and uh, to try and make you part of our community. And also, it'd be great if you can get out and do some activity. But other than that, going to sign off for today. Like I say, really, really enjoyed the one last night, and looking forward to the rest of the week. Uh, now all that presentation's out of the way. Now this is out of the way. I can go and extend that walk. Um, I think I'm going to do a, a good couple of miles tonight. You know, it's a bit fresh. It's a bit bit cooler again at the moment. The weather's a bit up and down. But I'm looking forward to getting out and just letting some of those uh, stressful thoughts disappear. But once again, keep at it, guys. Um, whatever you're doing. Oh, just one last thing. 
please, please post your songs. I'm I'm going to make us a playlist for the Saturday South for this week. Um, I do running playlist on um, Spotify. So please post them. Um, we did something similar with Do Running and everybody loves that playlist. We're always talking about it within within our sort of WhatsApp groups for the running clubs. So if you wanna if you wanna post your song, the, your favourite song to activity, please post it. We'll get a listing up on Spotify you can download and hopefully it'll just remind you a little bit of some of the things that have been said. I think that's the, the key to these playlists. They just they just tweak little memories and and little little things they do when you want in particular we remember nights out or certain races um, and it just helps it puts a smile on people's face and hopefully we can create something similar to that so please um, post them in the comments I'll also uh, post uh, post an article that I, I, I said I was going didn't I sorry about that um, got an article just before um, I came on today from a from a lady who, who's a student locally. She was doing a bit of a project and she wanted to write a piece on do running. So uh, I spoke to her in depth and she's done a, a lovely little article today. I was really pleased with that. I'm, I'm, I'd like to say well done to Laura for that. You really deserve some, some credit. Really proud of the piece. So um, I'll post that in the comments too. It'll just give you a little bit of insight into what we do here at do running and how we kind of operate. If you're not ever so familiar with what we do so there's a couple of things there to go at like I say make your comments on songs give that article a little read any comments on that as well we'd love that you know and like and sort of share the the post if you can if 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 you think anybody else can be sort of inspired by what we do please share it with them other than that just subscribe if you want to see more and we'll keep at it you know just doing it I am going this time cheers guys